So I tried removing the A, which I'm not quite sure what it stands for. I took a guess by removing the A and adding a two, and I found the code. But it turns out there's actually a service bulletin on how to read these codes. Let's take a look. They talk about what to expect when using the Information Control Unit service menu, along with instructions on how to convert the diagnostic trouble codes due to a temporary condition of them being presented in hex rather than the SAE as shown in the manual. This will be corrected in a future software update of the IFCU. We can only hope. A couple other interesting things about this bulletin. They mention that it may take up to 70 seconds for your trouble codes to display. So once you're on that screen, you really need to sit for a bit to see if any codes appear. They also mention the procedure of turning the bike on, ignition on, then turning it off, and then holding the trip switch and turning the ignition on. This is a bit different from the information provided in the service manual, where they say just hold the trip switch down and turn the ignition on. In this case, they want you to turn it on, then off, and then on. I, I'm not sure what difference that would make, if any, but they call it out here in the bulletin. They give us an example code of A2619E. And they state that the first digit A needs to be converted. So A equals B2. So in my case, I was getting an A as well. And if I convert that to a B2, I now have a match to the service diagnostics manual. And this is where I was getting confused. They provide another example. And then at the bottom, they provide a table of all the hex to SAE conversions. So I wanted to provide this update to make it easier for you to find your diagnostic codes. Again, my offer still stands. If you would like a copy of all the diagnostic trouble codes, send me an email and I'll send you back the codes. I also wanted to call out that we're very close to a thousand subscribers. If you're watching this video but not subscribed, I ask you to consider subscribing. But until next time, in the Friction Zone,